hello friends i am creating this 3d elevation this is the independent house i am creating in 3d max today we are just learning how to create independent house in 3d max okay then i am using 3d max 2009 okay just you first go to the customize menu and then go to unit setup you just check it what units you are using this this is the feeds and decimal inches i am setting the feeds and decimal inches then i am going to the system unit setup system unit scale inches then okay then okay then i am going to the this area just click on mouse right click this appears the grid and snap setting dialog box then you go to the home grid just grid spacing i am setting one feet so the every grid is uh, grid spacing is one feet okay then i am going to the snaps i am using end point just click on end point if you want another any snappings you just pick on and use it okay just i am closing this one next you select i am selecting in the front viewport okay then i am hold alt and w buttons then the front viewport is maximized then i am going to this panel and then go into the 2d geometry and then selecting this i am using the pan okay just okay this is one two just one two three four five six seven eight nine ten this is a ten feet height okay just i'm selecting line then i'm going to this area and i am hold shift when i am holding shift the line is create uh, moving straight line okay then just pick it and then go to the this area i'm taking two feet just again okay and okay okay this is the closed so this is closed spline okay next i uh, am adding thickness to this spline just go to the modify panel and you just see this modify list just then click it and you just select e button just you press e then appears this is the extrude you see this extrude okay uh, this is the area this is a, this is the spine this is the extrude and this amount is 9 inches i am adding the 9 inches thickness of this wall okay just enter okay just close it and then you push f3 okay then perspective view and z zoom okay you see this uh, spline having the extrude this is the thickness is 9 inches okay then i am pushing the f button i want front view okay then i am uh, when i am uh, push the f button this appears uh, in front view okay then i am adding hollow in this profile just i am selecting circuit and creating circuit okay then select spline just go to the modify panel and just push it and select the spline and you use the attach under shape okay when i am attach the shape to this spline the two splines is uh, uh, acts like a single object just then you push f3 you just you p then you push p button just you see how can i am creating this shape okay thank you very much next you see another video